We're coming to you live from Don't Ever Bank Your Field in Croxham Skull, Florida. It's over 110 degrees outside. Man, is it hot. The only difference between this place and an oven is that ovens don't produce serial killers. Pain, suffering, humiliation, and possibly a conga line. This game's going to have it all. The insane Colts go up against the Croxham Skull Jugulars. Welcome to NFL Game Day. Grim Blitzrow here. Let's listen in on the sidelines and hear what the team's captains have to say. It's time to turn on, tune in, and get your mutant buzz on. Hi, everyone. Grim Blitro here. It's MFL game day, and you know what that means. Yeah, the town will be in flames tonight, and half the city's population will be sliding down greased street poles and eating all-you-can-eat horseship buffets from the curb. Yes, victory can be bittersweet sometimes, Bricks. Let's see if the home team can light up this town like a Roman candle. And it's first and ten. Look out, that's an all-out attack on the QB. In some leagues, you aren't even allowed to touch the QB. In the NFL, they have plays just for killing them. <laughs> that's what I'm talking about. And it's first and ten. Play nets them seven yards. Oh no, I got the hiccups again. What are you supposed to do to get rid of them again? You stick it in a plastic bag, say the alphabet backwards while you set yourself on fire and jump out the window. It ought to stop them. And he held on to that one for a first down. First down and nine. And he put on the afterburners after that catch and scored. Nicely done. Some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven. What, and kick the kicker's job in half? They'd just be called sinners then. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuffed burrito from Taco Hell. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. That's a vicious hit, and the crowd loves it. He just turned that guy into 300 pounds of ground mutant me. And you can't hit a guy much harder than that. And that is unfortunate. A pickup of about three on that play. Second down and seven. First and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. You've got to catch that. Third and two. Hot, hot 
if he splits the upright from this far away, Bricks. If he doesn't, they're going to split his skull wide open. It's good. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Not a bad kick, but not a great one either. Well, his nickname is Lukewarm. And he's proud of that? Yeah, that's why he named And it's first and ten. Oh, this guy just loves punishing the defenders. That's a first down. And it's first and ten. Way to keep the chains moving. That was beautiful. <laughs> First down and nine. A nice run there for eight yards. And that'll bring up second and one. Touchdown! Oh, he ran through those defenders like a crazy turkey. And coach isn't liking that call. Oh, oh, his head just exploded. What a miss, what a miss. Ah, oh, shit. Second down, and, and the offense jumps off sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. Second down, and the offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. Second down, and we've got to pick up at least half of this. Oh, great pass on that play. They caught the defense napping. And that'll bring up third and one. A routine field goal, but as you know, nothing is routine in this league. And it's good! You know, Grim, in this league where murder and bribery are cheered, it's good to be good, huh? I mean, can we all just... Not this shit again. Bricks, I'm stopping it right there. He's going to be able to run this one back. I wonder if the kicker was setting up an easy kill. Oh, he just made mincemeat out of that guy. Hey, what is mincemeat anyway? Is it like bologna? Ah, uh, yeah, I'm going to get a sandwich. The burn returner was maimed by the opposing team, so it's up to the next man to replace him. Yeah, what exactly is a burn returner, Grim? You know, players who catch kickoffs and punts and run them back through the teeth of the defense. They have the lowest survivability rate of any player in the league. The next man up just sat back down on the bench. He probably cramped his pants. And it's first 
Division 10. And they've had enough. The offense jumps on sides and attacks the ref. First down in a mile. He's that guy's so fast, he can strike like old man about a six yard gain. Hey, do me a favor. If my parole officer calls, I was with you last night, Bricks. No problem. I spent the night in lockup for solicitation. He picks up nine yards on that catch. Third down and ten. Oh, with a punishing hit, the quarterback goes down. Hey, man, nobody can touch me when I ball. I take all you mutants out. That's right. Hey, what you talking about, pal? That's the end of the first quarter, and it's still anyone's game. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is superb, Grim. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. He's got the ball now and is going to try and score. Oh, what a great defensive play that was, Bricks. Kind of like your Aunt Bertha. This guy has some big balls. What a hit. Yeah, she does have a big pair, Grim. You're right. Quarterback drills one in for the first down. And it's first and ten. Defense holds him to a four-yard pickup there. Second down and six. Oh, great throw! Great catch! And that puts six points on the board! The defense can do anything to stop a thrown out good, man! You mean aside from bribing the ref, killing the quarterback, or actually playing some D? Well, why go for one when you could go for two? It's always been my philosophy, but Bricks can't even get one. Oh, you're talking about points. Two-point plays are high risk, high reward, and it just didn't pay off. And now they're both screwed and stupid. When you get knocked down, you got to get right back up and fight. Uh, what about when you get knocked up? What are you doing then? Run. Sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. <laughs> and they run it for a couple of yards. And that'll be second and eight to go. This guy's on fire! Does he like original or extra crispy? Now it looks like extra crispy. His cleats are caked in blood and guts, and he's looking to score! And it's first and ten. The defense better watch out! The quarterback just threw a murder ball! that one out of the air for a first down. See if they can get something going here. And it's first and ten. And this guy looks like Thor on a revenge bender. Oh, and he fumbles the ball on that hit. When you hurdle and get hit, chances for a fumble increase. And he's off to the races. 
He's at the 40. The 30. He's at the 20. He's at the 10. And he rumbles into the end zone for the score. I hope he's not going to dance now. See that, boo, baby? I'm the greatest. No, you didn't see that because I'm too fast. <laughs> Don't try to get fancy here. Just put the ball down and kick it. In that order, Grim? The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make them pay. First and ten. And he's off to the races. Look at that little mutant run. Uh, I don't think you can say that, Grim. Oh, and it's first and ten. It's two yard run before he stopped. And that'll be second and eight to go. And that's a catch for three yards. Third down and five. And he finds open spaces running toward the end zone. Turn on your jet, you son of a bitch. Six-yard gain. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them in the two-minute warning. Now I get it. Makes sense, Grim. And that'll be second down and four. Hot, hot one. Hot. Caught for the first down. The QB saves some clock by calling a timeout. They have one left. First down and six. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot three. And he just nailed him right on the numbers for a touchdown. point attempt. It's good. The home team is feeling confident as they get the kickoff into the air. Scoring makes anyone confident. It certainly does, Bricks. It certainly does. High five. First and ten. The defense calls us, and the home teammate catches the explosive ball. That's why you always have to listen in the huddle, kids. First down and forever. <laughs> C 
second down in a mile. Rumble for big yardage on that play. They're back in business, Bricks. My mom told me to stay out of other people's businesses, Grim. Third down and, well, good luck. Get your motor running. It's chainsaw time. <laughs> Satan Industries. We make genetically altered Franken food you'll have fun trying to identify. Well, the third quarter coming up. Bricks, this game has been a hot mess so far. Yeah, kind of like the morning after eating hot chicken wings. It's a hot mess on the exit ramp, if you know what I mean. <laughs> Looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one-time thing. several occasions not surprising multiple times on each occasion not surprising and trust me that hit was worse <laughs> picks up two yards on the pass then this guy's six feet tall he could just have fallen over and gotten two yards <laughs> And that'll bring up third and one. Hot, hot one, hot two. Hey. And that's a nice run for a first down. Yeah. Yeah. And it's first and ten. Hey. Nice pickup for six yards. And he reels that one in for a first down to keep the drive alive. And it's first and ten. Hot. Hot one. Hot two. Hot. And into the end zone for a touchdown. Once he got his hands on that pass, he was off to the races. Well, a little chip shot here, extra point, but this guy could blow it. Straight through the uprights. Let's see if they can keep the momentum going and keep these fans happy and uh, or bloodthirsty, whichever. If that hit didn't cripple him, it certainly left skid marks. And it's first and ten. That, my friends, was an all-pro NFL hit.
Second down and a lot. And the defense jumps up sides, trying to... If this guy could talk before he died, what do you think he'd be saying, Bricks? Psycho killer! Just to say, what the fuck, 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 fuck! <laughs> the offense lost another quarterback on the previous play and have only two left before they have to forfeit. Yeah, but on the bright side, win. they save a ton of money by not having to pay those guys anymore. And it's first and ten. Six yard game there. That's a solid pickup. I wish people would do solid pickups more often. I step in dog turns on my front porch every day. And that'll be second down and four. the way to move the chains that's good for a first down this game is all about momentum and killing <laughs> and it's first and ten second down and long Just left an outline on the ground like he was trying to wipe out the dinosaurs. Must be opposite day because he's the one who just got wiped out. <laughs> well, he just heard footsteps and took his eye off the ball. What a peck ahead. Catch the ball, asshole. Hey, asshole up here. Talking to you. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just guineas. The home crowd isn't impressed with that showing, but their team has a chance to respond. Oh, what a punishing hit that was. And that's how you make a guy remember your name and your shoe size, because he just walked all over him. And it's first and ten. Don't worry, if he shots you to... Oh, and the defender knocked the ball out when he was in midair. It is a fumble indeed. Fumble Banji, the new game from Wilton Crabtree. He scores! He earned those points on the heels of an epic run. Ah, don't call things epic, Crab. Kids aren't going to think you're cool no matter what you do. Junior, I don't want kids to think I'm cool. <laughs> Don't make any mistakes here, or they'll kick the shit out of you in the locker room. The kick is good! As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. When you give up points, you need to get them back. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if they can make him pay. And it's first and ten. It left the work speed through, and it picks up four on that pass and catch. Second down and six. And that'll bring up third down and seven. Oh, and that's when it feels like to have your teeth removed without Novocaine. If I had all my teeth knocked out like that, I'd have them made at the dice grim. It'll be fun to gamble with my own teeth! <laughs> Nicely done for a first down. 
And it's first and ten. And this guy just blew up and he's on fire. I'm not talking about one of those video game fire modes. I mean, literally, he's like burning bacon down there. Don't you just love the sound of bones snapping and cracking? I mean, when they're not yawn. And it's first and ten. That's a gain of seven yards on the catch. Nicely done. Second and three. And that brings us to the end of the third quarter. They'll need to fire on all cylinders to make a comeback in the final quarter. Second and three. First down with a nice piece of running there. First and eight to go. And he zips that one in there for a touchdown. They're going for two. And perfect pass for two points. That's a piece of art right there, Bricks. Yeah, man. The QB turned the defense into an abject mess. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. He sets up for the return. Let's see if he can break one wide open. And it's first and ten. I'm surprised no one uses the He's at the 40. He's at the 30. And they're catching up. Joke, job, do something. It's a touchdown. You know, letting these dogs into the league is a slippery slope, friend. First them, then vampires, then mermaids. Then before you know it, we're letting in cat girls. You know, things really start to get weird at that point. <laughs> Should be easy, but with kickers, you never know. It goes right through. Yeah, like a double stuff burrito from Taco Hell. They're looking for a good return after giving up points. Let's see how they do. Yeah, let's see if they always suck or if that was just a one time thing. First and ten. And the running game is starting to click now. A pickup of eight on the play. Second down and two. They could not connect on that play. Third and two. Oh, with a brutal hit. And it's first and ten. 
And offense says it's time to put the ref out of his misery. And the ref somehow escapes the onslaught. Here comes the penalty. First down in a mile. And the offense jumps on sides to kill the ref. They say, we're mad as hell and not going to take it anymore. down and forever and that's perfect coverage nice deflection second down and ain't gonna happen partner here. And he booted a high arcing rainbow. And he snags the punt and looks for open field. Oh, nice hit. And it's first and ten. The quarterback passes the ball and it rebounds back. He can't get rid of it. It's like me and these crabs. Oh, with the brain scrambler. Second down and ten. He had it for a second there. Third down and ten. Smart. Time to punt. Whoa, whoa, you can't say that on the radio. Nice punt. Should move him back nicely. And he's got a chance for a good return here. Oh, he just got crushed. And it's first and ten. in the second half. Second down in a lot. First time out to try and stay in this game. Oh, nice coaching move there. Hall of Fame caliber. Well, I mean, it's a pretty standard coaching move at this point of the game. I won't listen to this blast for me. And he 
punched his way out. Oh, devastating hit. You ever get hit that hard, Bricks? Yep. Third grade. Sister Mary Margaret. A timeout is called by the quarterback. They have one left. And the offense goes into their two-minute drill. Which coincidentally happens to be Bricks' match stupsing time. That's why the girls call me Speedy Gonzalez. And the team refuses to quit. They stay alive with four new downs. <laughs> and it's first and ten. The quarterback burns his last time out. They can't stop the clock anymore. The offense goes into their two-minute drill. What the hell is that? It's the same thing as a hurry-up offense, you moron. And then a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. Yeah. Oh, and did he just put on a display there? Touchdown! <laughs> now there are some who would argue that we should just skip this step and make touchdowns worth seven what and kick the kicker's job in half they'd just be called sitters then it's good The onside kick is a desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal a possession. Stealing ain't right, Grim. It just ain't right. And that, ladies and mutants, is how you recover an onside kick. When in a hurry-up offense, the offense needs to run out of bounds or take a timeout to stop the clock. And that is caught for a first down. First and eight to go. And he snags it for six. Touchdown! Touchdown! And they line up for the extra point. The kick is good. As expected, those are pretty much just gimmies. Here comes the kicker. Oh, I can't wait to hear this. What's the kicker, Grim? Uh, this guy in the field. Oh, I thought you were going to tell me a story like, here's the kicker. When I turned on the light, it wasn't a broad in my bed. It was Chip wearing a wig. And it's first and ten. First down. I've seen this guy drop a lot of balls in the past, but I heard the quarterback threaten to throw him a real bomb if he dropped one again. You know, good communication is important. We're deadlocked with a tie score at the end of the fourth, and that can mean only one thing. Stay tuned, because what the hell could be more important right now? Well, now that you mention it, Grim, I really need to hit the can. Breaks overtime is a war with some basic rules. The first touchdown wins the game, but if the team that receives the kickoff gets a field goal, then the other team is allowed a possession too. After that, whomever scores wins. Ah, uh, Grandma, I didn't understand any of that. Can you repeat it? Not a chance. 
And it's first and ten. Hot one. And he picks up about six on the play. And that'll be second down and four. And he gets three yards on that run. And that'll bring up third and one. And he sends him to the ground with an exclamation point. And a well-placed cleat. And it's first and ten. And he was running like he had a load in his pants. Picks up maybe two. Oh, we always ran with a load in our pants, Grim. It's a pretty good defensive tool. Yeah, except the zombies. They are freaks. And then it's a first down from a great catch. Was it a catch, though? Let's consult at least 72 pages of rules to figure it out. And it's first and ten. And he's able to grab that one somehow and hold on for the first down. This guy has a nice set of hands, Grim. It's the third set of hands he's had so long today. Looks like it's a good fit. Up maybe four on that play. Second down and six. This guy's going to get mugged in the locker room by his team after the game. Third down and six. He had it for a second there. They get ready for the kick. This isn't a gimme. right through. Yeah, like a double stop burrito from Taco Hell. The best kind of kick is when it's right after a score. Hey, speak for yourself. I'm usually the one who gets kicked after scoring. Pow! With the brain scrambler! And it's first and ten. He's not going down. First down. He hit that line the way a rolled up dollar bill sticking out of flimsy low hands nose. It's a mare in Lost Wages, Nevada. And it's first and ten. Quarterback threads the needle for a first down. And it's first and ten. The ground game should be their bread and butter. A gain of eight right there. Hey, anyone seen that Korean kid yet with my barbecue? Last time I ordered Korean, I got Kim Jong Il. Quarterback goes down. Zoom on his face. I want to see if he's crying. Hey, man, you see that? That's right. You can't handle this. You can't handle what I got. Yeah, get the hell out of here, man. Third down and long. for a first down. Ooh. 
First down and one. Ooh, hope he's got a good chiropractor. Second and three. That's a pass that went nowhere. Oh, that's like me at the hotel bar every night. Hey, maybe you need a better opening line than you want to see the teeth growing out of the roof of my mouth. What? The book How to Pick Up Girls and Tell Them Something You Need About Yourself. That's it. And he runs into the end zone for a touchdown. Listen to his fans howl. They love him. He came up as a teenage werewolf in the Mutant Farm League. I don't know. Jugulars got a taste of their own medicine, getting their jugular slashed and take a tough loss at home. They fought tooth and nail, but in the end, lose by three. It's a hell of a thing losing at home. They took away all they've got and all they're ever going to have. Yeah, well, they played like shit. Fuck them. Fuck them indeed, Junior. Let's get out of the field and see what that meathead has to say about his MVP award. <laughs> Once again, the folks at Evil SN thank our viewing audience and the Newton Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation. This is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. Today's final game stats are brought to you by the Microhard Corporation. They get it right every up.